In this video, I'm going to tell you every obstacle coming to Fall Guys Creative Mode. Let's go right into it. So before I start, big shout out to Fall Guys Muffin for the leaks and information for the video. So let's start with the confirmed obstacles that will be coming to Fall Guys. So the first one obstacle that will be coming confirmed it is for a carryable puncher so this is like the carryable fans and carryable blocks we have but instead of being a fan or whatever this would have another purpose that is a puncher that starts hitting everything so i don't know how this would work if it would hit the blocks it would hit the players when it would be triggered or whatever but this looks very cool and i would really enjoy to see this in the game in a creative mode the next one we have is buttons and triggers so this one is super cool and with this one actually we have some other obstacles that will be coming because for this obstacle the buttons and triggers you will push the button and then something would happen for it so it would be like a little bit like minecraft and all of these games so we have as well some icons that we don't know how they would really work and everything and we also have some floors that haven't leaked that are related to the buttons and triggers so it would be really interesting to see how the mechanics would work and everything and this one is my favorite and the one that excites me the most because with this buttons and triggers we get to super cool puzzle maps and mechanics and everything so this would really change creative mode as we know it right now the next one we have is force fields so this one is not super exciting i would say it's like it's very cool to have the force fields that go changing and you cannot like go through them it's a very exciting update i think it's something necessary and it would mix up the gameplay especially especially for races predicting the force fields and everything very cool 10 speed arches this is my favorite uh, of all basically because i really like these uh, speed run maps that are super fast and everything speed arches are super fun uh, we have them in track attack we have them in speed circuit and i really like them in those modes because you just go super fast and do the map super fast so this would be awesome to have in creative mode and then we would have this is not an obstacle but we will have as well confirmed to come before 2023 a sky fox selector so this is actually super cool as well because we now have a very limitations but if we could have more sky boxes and everything that would be awesome to have to just have a different feeling for each fall guys creative map so now i'm gonna say some leaked ones that are not confirmed to come anytime soon but probably they will be coming sometime the first one we have is spiky log this one looks absolutely super cool and we have two colors because obviously they want to release it in different themes so it would be really cool because actually we don't we only have this obstacle in one map and it's night fever uh it would be really cool to have this and com with combination of other obstacles and other types of ambience and everything then we have the original yetus so we have the hammer and if you turn it and you do it super fast you can still replicate the yetus in creative mode but the yetus as itself is not in creative mode especially the iconic puncher and everything so this one excites me so much and just doing the process of every time turning the hammers so it's a it becomes a yetus it just gets tiresome at, after a time so i think the yetus is a great incorpor incorporation also it will have su different speeds different sizes and everything so this one is super exciting to see also one of my favorite ones this is a movable obstacle and it's the blocks from slime climb so so many people have been recreating slime climb and i have played it in the videos but without these obstacles and without the rising slime it just feels different so these obstacles will be moving in and out and you will just have to try to avoid them this is a great incorporation it's like the punchers but more fluid and not just punches and then it comes back so we also have some flippers from another theme and some decorations from another theme that this is gonna probably come for uh, another themes and another puncher and buttons that these ones are themed with the space theme so this is cool to see but mo many of these obstacles we already have they're just in another theme then another obstacle we have is the drawbridge so the drawbridge is the one from uh, night fever as well and it's the bridge that opens and closes and yeah there's two themes for this one is the medieval theme and then we have the default theme so they have created the default theme so i'm really happy that they're creating also the default theme so we can use at least all the obstacles in one theme then we also have uh, some checkpoints for the eventually coming fall guys themes as you can see that are new this one so these are not currently in the game so these are basically new only for made for creative mode then we have movable obstacles this these ones are one of my favorite ones so we have moving bumpers that will be basically just moving side to side like we know and of a lot of maps especially slime climb and other ones like these and especially season one legacy maps 
Then we have the moving bumper ring. So this is used uh, for treetop tumble and some other maps like this that they just spin around. Also in some variations of gate grass, you can see them. And yeah, they just turn around and it's very annoying to go through. So it would be very cool if you want this in your map to have it. More exciting ones are the fans. So the fans currently, we have the ones that bring you up. The ones that stay uh, just just move you out, but we don't have any movable fans like there are in the game. So it would be super awesome to have them moving side to side and just pushing you and you try to avoid them. So this is one of my most exciting obstacles of all. And then we also have moving platforms. So this is also very cool because then we can do maps like Cosmic Highway and some other maps like this that have movable obstacles. And it would really change how the game is played in creative mode. These movable obstacles are really the future of everything. So continue. Continuing on, we have the roll on, roll off obstacles. So this one, as you can see, is that obstacle that just turns and turns and it has some obstacles in front and everything. So I'm thinking that we will have like three different variations of this one with different obstacles and everything. And yeah, pretty cool. Maybe we can change sizes and everything. So this one excites me, but I don't know if it will be coming soon as well. I don't really think so because I think it's a lot of work and the mechanics and movable obstacles are still in development. And the one that is very exciting is the hexagons i don't know if these ones will respawn i don't think so but still hexagons are very exciting to see in the game when i really enjoyed when we had season two free for all with all the hexagon variations and we just had hexagon in normal maps i really like the hexagons in fall guys so it would be really awesome to see them and race rounds, survival rounds, and all the rounds that are going to be coming in creative mode. So this is very exciting as well. So guys, as you can see, there were more than one theme in those obstacles. So we currently have digital and default theme for our maps. But in the future, they said that they will be adding a new custom, never seen before theme. And they said it will be coming very, very soon. So I'm very excited. I think it will be coming around October. And it's probably going to be Halloween theme. Uh, this is not confirmed or anything. This is just my thoughts since the fame pass 5 is halloween themed like the most leakers say it would be normal that the themes of the maps and everything is halloween but maybe it could be another never seen before theme and also we will have two themes that we already have in the game but we don't have in creative mode that's the medieval theme and the snow theme so this is very exciting we don't know when this will be coming but they didn't say it would be coming anytime soon so i think it will be coming in 2024 so i'm super excited for all of these updates guys and if you really enjoyed this video please subscribe to the channel and leave a like and yeah i'll see you in the next one